Yup, there we go. What's going on, everybody? Lakers Bucks reaction, the debut of Freak Time in Milwaukee. Here we go. Let's get this thing full screen. We got an HD. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Here we go. I am excited to watch this game. Reacted to two preseason games so far. Both of them involved the Lakers. Uh, we had the Warriors reaction the other day. Now we're talking about the Milwaukee Bucks right here. By the way, where does Freak Time rank on the all-time list of nicknames? Torian Prince, my MVP from that last game, comes out banging the three. Uh, Freak Time. I love the name Freak Time. I think it's hilarious. Although, the fact it is Freak Time in Cream City is a little... Uh, it's a little strange. By the way, Giannis, just because I'm talking, I'm not going to let you get away with this. Now, I know Giannis has been working out with Hakeem Olajuwon, but that's a travel at first. That's a travel right there. He travels again. I mean, look, he slides, picks it up, slides. It's like, it's like two or three travels. Giannis. Those are good travels. They're not going to call them on you, baby. They are not going to call them on you. You are too big. You're too dominant. They're not. They're going to let you get that. Rui, get the mismatch. A little dump inside from AD. Okay. No LeBron in this game, I'm noticing, obviously. Uh, no Reeves either. I uh, have to see. Who else are we missing? Oh. Okay. Um, too busy trying to figure out who we're missing on the court here. Gabe Vincent, maybe? I don't know if he's going to be starting out in the regular season. Christian Wood, good defense. Oh, Christian Wood. We were talking about him in the last game, too. Good block. Good block, Giannis. Um, we were talking about Christian Wood. Interested to see if he's going to... Where he's going to fall in the Lakers rotation. Looks like they got him starting this game. Good outlet, AD. Okay, AD getting his playmaker on. No LeBron in the lineup. AD said, don't worry, I'll play point. Since that trade... 500% increase as well to Bucks.com since the trade. So good Euro, too strong. Those are the those are the concerns with Christian Wood. I mean, it, nobody can stop Giannis, but not the best one-on-one -on -one defender. Such a pro's pro as And as I say that, he makes a great pass for an and one on 80. Good take. Wood puts it on the deck. A lot of contact. A lot of Christian Wood talking points here. I'm not gonna lie. There is absolutely no chance D'Lo is stopping that. On the offensive glass for the Bucks. I think I think you're seeing that. Oh, nice Ooh, good play, block, Brooke. good block, wow. Brooke Lopez. You've got stability. You've got veteran leadership. The time is now for Cam to settle. D'Lo take it inside. You can do that on Robin Lopez. Can't do it on Brooke Lopez, but you can do it on Robin. Both bring great physical attributes. Okay, Max Christie getting some early tick. Is that Bochamp? Bochamp with the block. A nice little dish to campaign. Can't forget, campaign no longer with the Suns. LeBron told him to stay humble. He gets gets his butt shipped out to Milwaukee. I mean, Milwaukee's still obviously a championship contender, but funny how life works sometimes. Got the reserves in there. Great pass from Connaughton. Just smothered by Jackson Hayes. More good rim protection from Hayes. That's something we saw in the last preseason game that we watched for the Lakers. Rui, sag him off, sagging off him, that's too much space. Lakers up by a point, end of the first quarter, just about. Cam Reddish got the ball now. Ooh, okay, little jelly, little jelly on the reverse, I like that. I had a little bit of jelly in my bag, not, 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 the, not the deepest jelly. Uh, as one of my friends said, it was more like grape concentrate than jelly. It was more of grape concentrate. I can do, I can... I can hit the jelly, I just can't jump that high. Oh! Yeah, I can't jump that high, so I'm not, I don't have enough hang time to really get a little get a little razzle-dazzle on it. Bobby Portis going inside. Jackson Hayes recovering. Oh, that's a great block. Just like the last game, they're showing us way more Lakers highlights. Bochamp knocks down a three. Bucks were 58 and 24 last season, and they lost in the first round by five. D'Lo heavily contested. Doesn't matter. I honestly think I've had this debate before. I honestly think D'Angelo Russell has one of the most unique games in the NBA. Now, obviously, I'm not saying he's the best, but it's one of the most unique, I, I, uniquely identifiable games. Because he's so shifty, but he's so slow. And a nice, nice dump off there from uh, Lopez. Nice, um, what was I saying? Um, he's so slow, and he, he has a good change of pace, but he just goes from slow to slower. 
it, it's almost like if Kyle Anderson was a point guard. I'm not comparing their skills at all, but it's just it's just interesting watching him play sometimes. This is a guy that made an all-star team, so more power to him. We haven't seen Dame score yet. As I say that, yeah, as I say that, we get a three. I feel like they would have shown us if Dame scored beforehand, so I'm guessing that was Dame's first bucket with the Bucks. Very interested to see how this team does. I know the Celtics are the betting favorites in the East, um, and maybe to win the finals, actually, but... My preseason favorites in the East are the Bucks for sure. They're gonna they're gonna obviously miss some of the things Drew Holiday brought for them, but I don't know why people great block AD. I don't know why people disrespect Dame. Like he didn't drop 55 and 10 with 10 threes in the playoffs. Like he doesn't have series ending buzzer beaters. I, his teams haven't been the best. I understand that, but him and CJ McCollum got to the conference finals against the Warriors. Yes, they got swept, but. This is Dame. This is this is one of the best closers in the league. Guy can give you 30 a night without without any problem. I think this team's gonna be really good. 60 plus wins, conference finals, finals. I see a lot of good coming for the Bucks. Good take. Good take by Dame. You have a lot of concerned fans that they've not yet seen Chris Middleton. Okay, so we still got we still got starters playing into the third quarter here. Dame pulling up off the screen. Too easy. Cam Reddish got to play tighter than that. Okay, so the Lakers, yeah, they got Lewis in the game, and they oh, was that I just realized they got Scottie Pippen Jr. in this game as well. So the Lakers are clearly playing the reserves. Bucks playing their guys a few more minutes, it looks like. Cam Reddish, can he get his NBA career going? Oh, that if he does that, he definitely can. That was nasty. Navigates like three defenders moving downhill. Strong finish. Absorb the contact. That's a great take by Cam. Malik Beasley. Even in practice, that was Malik Beasley, Beasley right? I think it was. Say, you want guard? Mm, I got you. Obviously familiar being in the Staples Center. Jackson Hayes is having one hell of a game. It's the preseason, dog. Calm down. Um, yeah, Malik Beasley familiar with this building, obviously. He played with the Lakers last year. Lakers trying to have a dunk party out there. He slammed that one. Says, hey, Jackson Hayes trying to get himself some starter minutes. Connaughton, good shot. Bucks up by 10. Cam Reddish, bad pass. I've seen some players, um, the one I can think of is Troy Young. I've seen players practice shooting off of bad shots like that. And every time I see people do that, is that a foul or a block? Oh. Good block, I guess, Lopez. Every time I see shooters grab the super low passes and then make the shot, I always think they're probably, I mean, I'm sure they are, but they got to be practicing that. One of the Antetokounmpo brothers, I believe that's Thanasis, gets stuffed. Thanasis makes up for himself. All right, looks like we're getting towards the uh, the bench and the reserves here. Failed, failed DHO. Jackson Jr., He's going to be fun to watch. Exciting rookie. Exciting rookie out of Utah. I do believe. Yeah, there's not a... Okay. Oh, ooh. Good adjustment. A little up and under. I like that. I am thinking of the right Jackson, right? That's the one from UConn. Those UConn boys, they're going to have some good some good players in the NBA. I'm excited to watch what, uh, what Jordan Hawkins does with the Pelicans. Maybe it could have been a travel. Maybe not. Castleton on the finish. Looks like the Bucks are going to pull this one out. Not that it matters a whole lot. It's the preseason. Connaughton just yanks one. Okay. And that's the dagger. So it looks like that's going to do it. Yeah, I mean, Scotty Pippen, there's no point. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, that's going to do it. Damian Lillard debut for the Bucks. Uh, should we look at the box score? I mean, we might as well. 
see. I don't have my laptop or my laptop. I don't have my keyboard with me. I have to use my laptop keyboard, which doesn't really work. So that's forgive the slow typing there. Okay. Um, box score. Wait. Oh, I was gonna say Anthony Davis did not chop 44 points. This is from however long ago. Wait, this is from, all right. Can we, are they really going to make me search for it by hand? Okay, here we go. Bucks. This looks like the right one. Fade. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. AD still does not have 44 points. Okay. Um, Lillard, I mean, 14 points. Sure. Good to see him out there. First, first game of the preseason. Giannis 16 and eight in 15 minutes. Crazy. Uh, Bobby Portis, campaign Connaughton. Yes, yeah, so, so, so the regular guys. Okay, that is Andre Jackson. Okay, this is exactly who I thought it was. Yep, UConn. Yep, yep, yep. All right. He's going to be fun to watch. I think the Bucks are a good fit for him. Anthony Davis, 16 points, 7 rebounds, 5 assists. And then Jackson Hayes with 4 assists. And, I mean, Scottie Pippen with 6, but he's a point guard. So, AD and Jackson Hayes stepping up, running some of the offense when LeBron's not in the lineup. Torian Prince, eight points, makes two threes. If he does that in the regular season, every game, the Lakers will be perfectly happy. D'Lo, double digits. Uh, Cam Reddish, 10 points, four of 11 shooting, five fouls, five rebounds. Going to need to cut that down and make the rotation. Max Christie, 10 points, Scotty Pippen, nine. Okay, that's going to do it for this video. Uh, how far away are we from the regular season? We're like, are we, I think we're eight days away Matter of fact, let me just double check this preseason. So the Lakers got one more. I know the Lakers are playing opening night, so I'll just check. Yeah, we got eight more days, and we got the Lakers versus the Nuggets, and I forget what the other game is. Uh, you know, I might as well check since we're here. Uh, the other game on opening night, we got Lakers, Nuggets, and we got Suns, Warriors. I couldn't remember if it was the Warriors or the Celtics that were playing. Okay, guys. That's going to do it for this video. Like the video if you did enjoy. Uh, comment, let me know which of these teams you think has a better chance of winning the finals, Bucks or Lakers. Subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you all in the next video.